One band leader is expressing disappointment with officials at the Tobago Festivals Commission. On Carnival Saturday, her band was disqualified from the downtown Scarrow competition after an official from the commission told her that her band would not be allowed across the stage. For the past five years, Bagatelle resident Janelle Eastman has brought several productions in both the junior and senior band competitions for Carnival. This year, however, her junior band of Fancy Sailors was debarred from taking part in the downtown Scarborough competition. She explains. My band was already in town by Minister Four. My band was already down in town. Half was up by Tamarin and half was down, went down to Market Square side down there. And we got a phone call stating that we shouldn't bring our band again because we're late. And I know that we wasn't late because we have until six still to cross the stage. Now we had keep in contact with other band members like Miss Maslin, Ned and Associates because we usually go down the road with them. And they were waiting to be judged so then we were next. Eastman noted that junior bands which fail to cross the judging points are usually fined $5,000. But is she prepared to pay this fine? I intend not to pay. They have to take me to court because I have witnesses that I was already on the road. My band was on the road. What time your band was on the road? My band was on the road before four. Further, the band leader says she is displeased with the performance of the festival's commission over the 2013 carnival period. Uh, at the beginning of the, f the carnival season, they all told everybody to bring in their synopsis for the band, for the kings, for the queens and individual. Upon visiting each judging point, I met with problems with my synopsis was not present. Uh, they didn't know who was the queen of the band, who was the individual, what portrayal the band was carrying or the king or queen. Everything was totally mixed up on Monday. I had problems with my traditional band. When I went to play, I, they had me down as fancy Indians instead of fancy sailors. She said she, along with other band leaders, have lodged their complaints at the Festivals Commission office where they were told by officials that an investigation would be conducted. In a response to Ms. Eastman's complaint, Carnival Committee member Olimar Gordon Holder told Channel 5 News that Eastman's band was disqualified because she was late. She said at approximately 10 past 4, some of the masqueraders from Ms. Eastman's band were still at Tambrin Square, Uptown Scarborough. She stated that these masqueraders informed her that they were waiting on the other members of the band to arrive. Gordon Holder said the rules of the competition clearly state that all bands must be at the judging point before 4 p.m. She said Eastman's band was nowhere near the judging points, which were both located on Milford Road, Lower Scarborough, opposite Sings Hardware and Ashura Court.